Welcome students to this week's spelling video. Let's make sure you have all your needed equipment. Okay, we have our handy dandy glue stick, our sharpened pencil, of course our scissors, spelling notes, sorry, not spelling notepad, spelling bag, or your envelope that has your spelling words. You have your spelling journal, language journal, and of course you have your words. This week we are doing sort 50 suffixes ENT, ENC, ANT, ANCE. First thing we need to do is cut them out. But in case you left them at school, you can make your own words by looking at these words and making your own word boxes. If you need to, you know that you can pause the video at any time to do that. All right, so I am going to cut these out, but I'm going to pause my video and cut these out. Remember to keep your title or your label to put in your notebook. Okay, so see you in a minute. Hey, okay, we are back. So I have my label, I have all of my words stacked, and I have my exemplars. So time to get my spelling journal. Find my first clean page. and I need to glue in the label first thing. Get your handy dandy glue stick. And glue that in right at the top. Also, don't forget to put your name in the corner and the date. That's always important to have in there. All right, next thing I need to do is write my exemplars. So we need to write nice and neat. These words are going to be a little bit big, so you need to make sure you have enough room. So we're going to do hyphen ENT, scoot over, hyphen ENCE, hyphen ANT, hyphen ANCE. All right, so there's, put that back in my, either my bag or my envelope. Now underline those. All right, so we need to find some words that have these in it. But we're going to have a clue here. I, I'm arranging these so that ENT and ENC are close together. ANT and ANCE are close together because those are the suffixes that give you the clues to what we are going to write. Not necessarily write, we are going to write them, but the words that go together. So I'm going to spread my words. You can't really see this on the video, but I'm going to spread my words all around my Like I said, notebook. you can't see it, but my words are spread all the way out. So what I want to do is find two words that are similar that have ENT and ENCE. Okay, so here is confident and confidence. Now I want to find some words that have the, the A-N-T and the A-N-C-E. So I have fragrant and fragrance. Okay. The key to understanding these suffixes is this. If you know how to spell one word that ends in E-N-T and E-N-C-E or A-N-T and A-N-C-E, then you can figure out how to spell the word about which you're uncertain. For example, if you are uncertain whether a spelling is A-N-T or E-N-T, but let's say you know that confident is E-N-T. And when you have to spell the word confidence, because confident is E-N-T, you should remember that you spell confidence E-N-C-E. Okay, confidence sounds we say confidence, confidence, we say confident, and you know, the way we say it in our own language is sometimes people use a little slang or they have their own little way of saying words. So you have to remember how to spell these. Also, ENT and ANT signal adjectives and ENCE and ANCE signal nouns. So confident is a descriptive word, and confidence is just a noun. So those should also help you. But let's go ahead and get started and do a couple of these. So this is pretty straightforward. So I have confident, so I'm going to write that. But 
I like to say the word, spell the word, and then say the word again. Confident, C-O-N-F-I-D-E-N-T. Now, say it as you write it. Confident, C-O-N-F-I-D-E-N-T. Make sure you're trying to write neat so that you can read your own writing and the teacher can read your writing. So again, I'm going to put these side by side. So I'm going to put confidence right next to it. S confidence, C-O-N-F-I-D-E-N-C-E. -E. You can pause the video and do that if you would like. C-O-N-F-I-D-E-N-C-E. -E. See how they work together? So underline E-N-T, underline E-N-C-E. -E. All right, let's do the next one. Fragrant, fragrance. Fragrant, I'm going to do first. F-R-A-G-R-A-N-T. F-R-A-G-R-A-N-T. Fragrant. Underlined the last part, the suffix. And then fragrance. F-R-A-G-R-A-N-C-E. F R A. G R A N C E. Underline the ants in there. All right, so there are your words. Now, there's some words that might be a little bit hard if you need to ask your mom or dad to help you. Please do that. Again, remember to pause your video. This is pretty straightforward as long as you remember the little clue about finding words that are similar, knowing which one is ent or ants, and finding the other one that goes with it. What I would like you to do now is do all your pairs of words. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more pairs of words that you need to fit in there. You need to do that yourself in your own spelling journal. Get it done. Have fun. Ask your teacher if you need help. Ask your parents if you need help. We'll see you at school.